Uh, hello everyone, oh, welcome back to a new video. Um, today we're going to do a full run of the Amnesia Justine um, bad ending. And let's do not um, make the intro so long uh, since um, we have finished the game already and our conclusions or speculations were correct. Um, the character we're using or controlling is Justine and um, the experiments is revolving around her and was first started by his late father which is um, the friend of Daniel on the first game. Uh, let's continue, uh, I mean, let's start since um, we have played this already so we know the drill and let's go ahead and do not make, uh, let's not make the intro very long, okay? Uh, I will uh, prevent myself from talking about uh, through this run uh, for me to focus and avoid any mistakes. disembodied voice. It will serve you no purpose to look for me, for this is a voice from the past. I bid you welcome to my cabinet of perturbation. It is my study of the human psyche, specifically yours. A set of recordings have been prepared to chaperone you through the chambers ahead. There are a few parts to this study, and it is up to you, not only to pass, but to figure out what elements are important. Please go on. Move into the next chamber. Just remember, they can all be safe. There is always a way. If you could help me, I would be much obliged. Help me! Please, help me!
enemy. It's not too late to set things right. Congratulations for coming this far. I'm so excited for you. I do hope you managed to save Monsieur Fournier. He was a friend, and a colleague of my papa, you know. Friendly fellow, a real bon garçon, but frail of mind. He puts up an impressive front, but it is all an act, I assure you. Please, go on. We are just getting started. divine inspiration. Time to delve into your spiritual side. What do you see? Is the man begging for mercy, or is he being blessed? Perhaps both. Father used to say there were no right answers. Have the light guide you. Who, who are you? Who's there? Oh, have mercy! <laughs> <laughs> 
Father David with his god now? Maybe you helped him there. Don't you worry. I'm sure he didn't have a family. He probably wasn't even all that well liked. With the current political climate, I'm surprised someone hasn't killed him already. We can't all be saved. Some don't even want to be saved. Yes, that is a comforting thought. Saves us from trying. out how it all works by now. Are you enjoying my quips? I think they are quite clever. Not that I was ever much of a conversationalist. Poetry has always been my forte. But I digress. You should press on. It will all be over soon. Also, the police are here. Maybe they can help you. Are you still with us? 
I'm looking forward to see if you manage to save him or not. I know very little about him, but surely he had a family, don't you think? Poor, poor fatherless children. But he falls on his own sword. His kind is not meant to come for people like me. Laws are made for credits. The aristocracy doesn't need to know right from wrong. We are always right. Well done. You have triumphed. Conquered my cabinet. I wish I could tell you how you did, but alas, this is a recording. You will have to figure it out all by yourself. Did anyone survive? The doctor? The priest? Or perhaps the policeman? Who is allowed to live? Why? You should really reflect on these past events and consider what they meant to you. What you have learned about your true nature. Father never knew me. He thought he did, but then he was frightened. And nothing was ever the same again. I can still see him, lying there on the floor. He looked so surprised. The star-shaped soapstone stained by his blood fell to the floor with a sonorous thud. Blame me not, for I was but a child. With careful ambition, I dare to smile. Rest in peace, Papa.
This... This was the best one yet. So elaborate. It's just... too much. Enough of this. Get up, Justine. This isn't over yet! It's already locked, but you can never be too certain. Yes, coming in here. Mademoiselle Justine, are you down there? Is everything all right? Of course, Clarice, I'm quite all right. Is everything ready for tonight? Yes, the goose is ready any minute now. The guests should be arriving within the hour. Did I hear voices from downstairs? I certainly hope not. Oh, <laughs> silly me. <laughs> yes, silly Clarice. So that is the bad ending of Amnesia, Justine. Um, all three um, prisoners were killed. Um, so we aren't able to um, save them all. In the end, Basil was the one who was chasing us through the door. Um, if you can remember on the series, um, the last episode of Justine uh, that we have made, uh, all the three were like excited um, for us to open the door. Um, however, they're not able to go out yet. And that is a good ending because all of them are alive. However, they are still unable to uh, get out of the cabinet as Justine uh, called this place. So I hope you enjoyed that. Um, that is the full recording or the full game of the bad ending of Justine, Amnesia Justine. And I'll see you in the next one when we do the uh, good ending, full game of Amnesia Justine. Uh, I think that is the most difficult um, uh, series, uh, full game to record since um, we have to be very precise on what we have to do since we have to save them all and we'll try to see that in the next episode i'll see you I'll see you then